and see as I'd like to talk more about Wi-Fi Halo. What is that exactly? So Wi-Fi Halo is um, a term that was coined by the WFA, the Wireless uh, Wi-Fi uh, Alliance. And it is sort of a sort of a follow-on to IEEE's 802.11ah. Basically, it's a sub -gig, it's a standard for sub gigahertz Wi-Fi. And so, what Morse Micro does is we build chips that support the sub gigahertz Wi-Fi. How's that an advantage over normal Wi-Fi six? Well, for cost? Yep, it's basically a long-range, low-power alternative to regular Wi-Fi. So compared to conventional Wi-Fi, it's much lower in power, it's much longer in propagation, and it's much better in terms of penetration. So what that enables for the end product is for you to be placing devices that have the connectivity that's more reliable in locations that you cannot with conventional Wi-Fi. So can I put a camera on my mailbox up front of the house? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And if your mailbox was a kilometer away, it will still work. Still, yeah. Yeah. Right. So yeah, so we um, so to, to elaborate on what Prakash said, so traditional Wi-Fi is basically 2.4 gig, 5 gig, and 6 gig. And, and and basically those higher frequencies don't propagate as long through free space, and they don't propagate through objects as well. Sub gigahertz in North America for Wi-Fi Halo runs 902 to 928 megahertz. And we have, we have much smaller um, uh, channels, so we'll support up to eight megahertz channels. So we can get 32 and a half megabits per second fire rate, which basically allows you to do eight full HD streams. But as Prakash had pointed out, we just did a test in San Francisco. We can get not, you know, not tens of meters, but kilometers of, of range. So we just did full, really demonstrated yeah. full video at three kilometers in San Francisco. So I mean, in our industry, you know, Wi-Fi do doorbells and cameras, real problems like keeping them connected right. to the network. Right. So I, I see that you partner with a with a phone on a on a Wi-Fi right here. Is, is the object here to I you know just kind of overcome those issues in the home? Or? Yeah. So Abode was one of the early adopters of our technology. So wireless cameras and battery-operated cameras, in particular, kind of suffered from three problems: very poor connectivity because the 2.4 gigahertz spectrum is very noisy and it doesn't do well through objects and over distance. Um, battery battery life, and then and then really really weak AI, or in, in most cases no AI. So Abode partnered with Morse Micro and Zalian to build the, fir the world's first Wi-Fi Halo AI-enabled camera. So what that, what that allows them to do, so the AI does a couple things. It allows you to, to pre-register faces so you can tell if your daughter's home. It allows you to really intelligently turn on and off the camera when there's an event that you care about. And so that, that extends the battery life. It's about five amp hours in the abode camera that you can extend the battery life to six plus months. And with a Wi-Fi router? Halo, now you can connect it to kilometers. Do you need another router for it, a new router? Or you so you need a, a, a bridge, so they, a boat sells this kit, so this will attach to an access point or the back of a router, and then they have a camera here that attaches to this. That's right. Super easy setup. Sorry, yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. jumping in, I'm jumping in. No, no, please, please. No, so yeah, so, the, so we made the hub with, with multiple ways for the user to connect the connect the hub to the internet, essentially. So. so it's all about improving the user experience, so that when the, so users today they, they take they get a wireless camera, they put it someplace, they can't they, they they have a dead spot in their house, they won't connect, and so this opens up a whole a big wide area of places you can connect cameras you couldn't before, and for enterprise security. You know, in most of enterprise security today, it's PoE. But if you think about, if you want to put now a camera on top of a light post, now you don't have to dig a trench. Or the mailbox example is a great example. In our test house in Portola Valley, we have a camera in our mailbox. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you.